And whenever you're ready, sir, you can go ahead and begin. Interviewing people is always a fun experience. The person I was chosen to interview is Samuel Gray. He is from Havel, Slovakia. He lives there with his parents, his 8-year-old brother, Nathaniel, and his 15-year-old sister, Sarah. His father works as a pastor at the local church, and his mother works at a school in town as a special education teacher. Now, Samuel doesn't have a middle name, and he says it is due to it being very uncommon to have one in Slovakia. In fact, he estimates only 5% of people have one. This is Samuel's first year at St. Paul before coming here. Samuel spent 11 years at his local school. Samuel has always wanted to come to the United States for an exchange year, so he was incredibly excited about coming here. He heard about the St. Paul program from a past student named... Monty <laughs> Trepaj. <laughs> yeah. Luckily for Samuel, his parents were incredibly supportive and encouraged him to follow through with the program. Samuel is very glad he decided to come here and enjoys all the activities he's partaken in so far. Before coming to the United States, Samuel worked as a cameraman and journalist at a local television station, where his job was to go throughout the city and ask people various short questions and create video material through editing. Samuel often spends his free time doing many of the activities he loves, such as sports, music, and reading. Samuel plays violin and guitar. He started playing violin in first grade but sadly did not start learning guitar until his 7th grade year. He learned violin from a tutor, but everything he knows on the guitar is self-taught. Samuel's absolute favorite sport is hockey. Since he loves to skate, he's fairly good at the sport, and he enjoys the overall mechanics. He also follows the NHL, and his favorite team are the Edmonton Oilers. Other sports he enjoys are soccer, track, swimming, skiing, and floorball. Samuel loves literature. His favorite book is Do Hard Things by the Harris Twins. He loves this book because it encourages him to truly challenge himself. Samuel also loves geography because he enjoys traveling and learning about new countries and their cultures. Although Samuel knows what he loves, he's not particularly adamant about what he wishes to pursue in the future. Samuel does, however, know he is interested in sports commentary or following in his father's footsteps and becoming a pastor. <coughs> He is also interested in becoming a pastor because he loves how Christ helped various strangers throughout his ministry, which is why Samuel often looks up to him as a role model. After high school, Samuel wants to study a few years in Slovakia, and then study abroad and travel around the world, and maybe visit some of his many dream locations, such as Tierra del Piega in South America. Samuel Gregor lives a fun and interesting life, and he has a bright future ahead of him. His ability to go every day, always finding a reason to smile, never ceases to amaze me. Thanks for listening, and I'd like to thank Samuel for giving my late talks about the speech. <laughs> thank you very much. Let's give him a round of applause. Thank you, Gideon, and thank you, Samuel.